I am just so, I am so nervous. I can't. Oh, what if it runs my eyebrows? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am super excited and nervous about today's video because I am going to do a first impression and review of a product I have never tried before, even considered trying before, or quite frankly, even knew that they had out on the market. So, here we go. I am so scared because I am going to be doing an at-home eyebrow tinting kit. If you are anything like me, you have commitment issues to the microblading side of things. I cannot get with the tattooing of my face. And then you have the issue of wanting to go to the henna shop or the threading shop and letting them tint your eyebrows and not having the time to do it. Because I have to pick or choose. It's like either my eyebrows or my nails. Like there's I can't do both. They're just too time consuming and I have to do one or the other, especially whenever it comes to being away from my baby. So I typically choose my nails because every girl needs a pedicure every once in a while. Okay, amen. So moving on, let's try this. Today I have the Bay Brow. This is the instant tint. So this apparently you leave it on for no more than 10 minutes. Most people say about three to five is what they like to do and it will stay for up to one week. I am happy that it's only for one week because if this is horrible, at least it will go away. So I'm trying to take deep breaths and not be as nervous as I am on camera. Okay, so I'm just gonna dive right in. I got the tint, the brush, the headband. I even purchased a couple of these little razors that they have because they do have some razors if you are interested in anything like that. So without further ado, Let's tint our eyebrows at home. So I'm gonna put on the headband. I did get this headband on their website. It's Bay Brow. I thought this was so cute. And y'all know I like headbands. Okay, let's tuck my hair in here. Okay, they say first steps first is to cleanse your eyebrows with a non-oily cleanser. I have already done that off camera and dried them completely. Step two, apply an oily cream such as petroleum jelly. I have Aquaphor by Pound at this house, so I'm gonna use that. They say to apply it to the skin around your eyebrows that you do not want tinted. So I'm gonna do this part with a Q-tip. All right, I'm going above my eyebrow because it would scare me to get it on my forehead. Let's not. I, I don't want to like over petroleum jelly because I want it to work. What if this is terrible? What if, the, what if for like the next week I have like horrible eyebrows? I have never in my life considered doing something like this at home. So they say this one is a clean formula. There's no hydrogen peroxide or PPDs in it. So yeah, let's do it. I am ready. I'm fully prepared. The headband is on. The petroleum jelly is on. Literally, now it just says to apply the tint. First, okay, first, let's talk about the product packaging. That's so cute. I do, I like anything that's black and pink or black and nude. Whew. Okay, here's the scary stuff. It's just a wand. Okay, so here, let me tell you guys the color that I got because there's a couple different color options. I got it in dark brown. I have dark brown hair. Some people got get it in like um, graphite because they say that it works better because they have like ashy hair. I'm so nervous. I'm just talking my way out of doing this. Now I'm just rambling. Okay. Okay, here we go. I'm going to look in the mirror and not talk because I'm scared that if I talk and my cheek moves, that I'm going to ruin this. So I'll put some music here for you. Enjoy. I feel like I'm done. 
I don't want to put too much on. <laughs> I'm so scared. I don't feel like I've ever been more scared than I am in this moment right now. But it says to wait two to three minutes minimum. Most people wait five. Maximum is ten. I think I'm going to go five because that's what no, most do. And my hair is dark brown. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope that this is good because I would love, love, love for this to be as good as I'm hoping because it was very easy to apply. It went on very easily. Um, I'm just nervous. I think I am most worried that this is going to be awful. Okay. Time has come. It has been five minutes. I am ready to get this stuff off of my eyebrows and hopefully it will be great. So it says on the instructions here to wipe it off with a cotton wool pad that is damp. So I have done just that. And it's the moment of truth. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared I can't even wipe. Okay. You don't have to take it off. Okay, I'm not gonna get overly excited. I don't have it all the way off. Girl. <laughs> Do you see that? Oh my gosh. I may never go back to a threading place again. Shut up. Look. Okay, so that one's making me a little nervous. A little spot in this one. Oh, okay. Oh, I got it. You just had to clean it a little. I am shook right now. Okay, first of all, the sunlight just started coming in perfectly from my window as I took that off. If that's not a sign, I don't know what is. Do y'all see this right now? Do y'all see this? Do you see my eyebrows right now? I'm actually shook. I have been going to a threading place to get my eyebrows tinted for three years now. Well, I say that three years before my son was born because now I just don't have time. And now I do like I did this in five minutes in my own home for $19.99. I 10 out of 10 recommend it. You guys, if you are looking for something that is quick and easy and only going to take you a few minutes to get done and look like this. 100%. Click the link down here. I will absolutely post one for you so that you can get your own. I will be using this again. I hope you guys love it as much as I do. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Leave me a thumbs up if you like this video and want some more. Thanks again for coming by my channel and have a great day, guys.